leaving Walmart. Walmart? What? No, we're not. We're going to Walmart. Uh, we are leaving Metro Town. Successful. A, uh, successful shopping for Leslie and me. I got a Lulu shirt. We'll have to do a haul once we get home. That's what we can do when we get home. That's no, fun. I think do it tomorrow because you need to go to bed by the time we get home after going to Walmart. It'll be late. I need to shower real quick. I was sweating yeah, so storm today too. So no, we will not do a haul. We will do a haul tomorrow, but it doesn't really matter what day it is because it'll probably go up around the same time as this anyways. Uh -huh. So we will do a haul tomorrow. So we'll do a haul tomorrow. Because um, I'll, I'll do a haul, I'll do I'll a haul tomorrow. A link, I'll share a link somewhere in this video before that haul so you can just click on it. Um, otherwise, we I went to Lulu and I picked up a nice shirt. We've been talking for a long time to do a nice shirt for me, but because I did flat step deck, Carping, strapping, all that stuff. It, it would have got ruined. In it would have like got ruined day. like in a second. Not to mention all the, stuff, the sharp objects that I work with. But now that I think I'm driving it, oh, I'll be driving a van. Um, I don't think anything I'm picking up will be that sharp or that dirty. Where I'll actually have to worry about it. Um, I picked up. Uh, I got some new uh, steel-toed shoes because the last ones I had I bought when I was in high school. So. They're, they're, like actually, they're actually kind of gross. They're pretty much 10 years old, I would say. Even if you got them in grade 12, that's still like... I did get them in grade 12. Okay, so you were 18. At, like, at the very latest, you were 18. So that means that they're at least 9 years old. That's gross. So yeah, they're old. They stink. My feet like absolutely stink in them, so they're, they're time to go. So I got some new ones that are lighter and a little more look like a shoe. I, there are some other ones that my old boss used to have some slip-on ones that look like... What am I wearing now? What are these vans? Yeah. They're like flat vans sh shoes, like not high tops or anything. They're just like flat, nice shoes. But he had slip-on ones that had the steel toe in them. So I gotta find, just see if I can find those because those are, uh, they make it easy to drive in. And I'm not like in a warehouse, like muddy kind of situation where I don't have to worry about any of that kind of dirt stuff. It'll just be in and out of buildings. Um, at least for the summer. Uh, I don't mean like summer, like it's gonna, like I'm gonna go into dirt after it. It's just gonna be raining, and I'll have to maybe find other shoes that are a little bit more waterproof. So we did. We found me shoes. We found me a shirt. So I have a nice shirt that I can keep me not so sweaty in the, in the summertime since it'd be hot out and doing different kinds of work. And hopefully and we can build you a collection of them, but it'll have to be a little bit yeah. at a time. Because if we bought him five of them, for, or four of them, because you work four days a week, if we bought you four, one day, for, one for every day that you work, that would be like almost probably like $300 in t-shirts. That's ridiculous. Be well worth it. Yeah, but not at, all at once. Cause yeah, I mean, I, I got like two dresses, a pair of pants, two tops, a pair of shoes and a sweater. And all of that together was like $150. So I got all of that and you would get a set of t-shirts for like double the price of all of that. So yeah, so then we went to Susie Shear and I got, like I said, two dresses, two tops, no, oh, no, yeah, two tops, a pair of pants, and then we went to Winners and got a cardigan so I can maybe dress up some of the stuff that I already have for my new job. And then we went to Payless and got a pair of heels that are actually probably will work with most things. So I can switch between heels and flats depending on the day and the outfit and the weather. Um, and you should go back for the, yeah. the BOGO and not the matching ones to you. <laughs> How would that make you feel? Make me feel horrible if that's what you're asking. Why? If you go straight, we could go to Walmart Queensboro, or do you want to go? To... No, I don't want to go that way. It's yeah, so small. let's go straight. So go straight then. I know. Yeah. Okay. I'm just making sure. So we'll do a haul video. We'll explain everything else that we got because Leslie got a lot. So we'll show you all that during the haul video, which again I'll link to to this. Um. Um. And then. Now we're just off to Walmart to go get me some lunch for tomorrow because. I don't know what I'm going to be like for lunch or what the roots are like or anything, so... Um, plus it'll be a little bit uh, easier because I'll be driving a semi-truck so I can't just pull into McDonald's with that. Yeah, that's... yeah, it doesn't really work. So off to Walmart. We'll vlog at Walmart. We will actually vlog at Walmart. Pinky promise. We will vlog at Walmart, okay? Because we don't vlog in public. We really don't. We vlog when there's no, no one we around. No, we vlog in public. Where? 
Where do we vlog? It's always after we. We're not no, doing things. No, the White Caps always... games, and in the Sky Train, the White Caps on the way home. Oh yeah, I guess so. And then we and we're walking to the White Caps game. Yeah, but there's no one when we're walking to the White Caps games. There's no one around. That's what I'm saying. There's no one to look at you weird. Like when we're walking to the White Caps games, we're on like a street that's got nobody. Well, the last in time it. we vlogged in Walmart, we got photo, we got uh, video bombed in the background. So we'll find out if that happens again. That was in Muskegon, Michigan. Mm -hmm. On the other channel. Your channel. Okay, we'll see you in a bit. We failed, we were talking. But no, no, you failed actually. I, was, okay. I didn't fail. I don't know what you're talking about. This is very odd, you know that? Why? There's actually people that don't understand these things around. And I know. it's not a situation where you would actually necessarily be filming yourself. You could film yourself at a White House game. You could feel yourself filming yourself maybe on the sky train for some odd reason, but at the grocery store? Not so much. Not a normal uh, place to be filming. Okay, so we're shopping. No, don't keep, keep going. What are we getting? What are you getting? What are you making? What am I I'll making? I'll do it when we get there. Oh, come on. Are you kidding me? Stop electrocuting just... me. Stay strapped to me. I think you don't have your nose number to ask him. Do you just record me being ridiculous? <laughs> you recorded this, didn't you? You recorded you doing this? Yep. now just leaving Walmart and heading home so I can make Steven his lunch for tomorrow and then uh, nope I was gonna stop at the gas station real oh quick. okay then we're gonna go to the gas station first and, and then we're gonna and then a can pop and his person's apparently a like double tricks. loser the ultimate loser um I'm gonna go home and make Steven his lunch and then he's gonna have a shower and then he's gonna go to bed and I'm gonna watch my two shows and then I'm gonna go to bed and then he's gonna get up stupid o'clock early and this person doesn't know where they're going and yeah that is our day it is five to ten and he has to be at work in eight and a half hours I can't take that feeling anymore why? because I need eight hours to sleep straight you guys are all over sleep? Um, yeah. Well, at this point, I feel like you should be a little, at least a little bit tired. Yeah, a little bit. Of, I want to be like. Exhausted? Yeah. I mean, if you watch TV and I cuddle you for a little bit, that might not be too bad. I have two shows to watch. I should be asleep in two hours. I should have a hot shower and just go straight to bed. Yeah. Side. Mm -hmm. 
I don't like that other sale. There was homeless people asking for money. Mm. So then go down, make a make a left where the sky train is, and go up a, up a block, and then make a right, and then make a, another right. Then you'll be on the right street. means you actually would have wanted that lane. Here, because I didn't really want to go through like dealing with like people at the sky train. We went to there and then went up. 